Anyway, let's get on with it and find out how you do a tightness test with this new DC 711. Come on then. Now the first way I'm going to show you how to do a tightness test using this DC 711 is by actually using the screen. The other way we're going to do it is by using my smartphone and using the app. So what I have done is I have connected the tube going from my P plus here on the right hand side of the analyzer over to the gas meter here. First thing I need to do now is using the buttons here is scroll down and get into the tightness test section. So we can now use this down arrow to go down to tightness. Then we need to accept it using this button. And now on the screen, you can see it says pressure in millibars and it actually says pressure it's reading in standby. So what we need to do is take this pressure to between seven and 10 millibars for our let by test. So you can see we're round about 9.6 millibars so I'm going to press F2 because it says enter so we need to press F2 it now has come up on the screen it says our let by it says P1 P2 what our difference is and how long our time is and again we need to press F2 to start and this will now give us our pressure and count down for our first minute now you can see our minute is up it says our initial reading was 9.721. It says our finished reading is 9.849. So we've had a slight increase of 1.2. So F2 again because it's passed. Now we need to increase our pressure to between 20 and 21 millibars. Now you can see our reading is about 20.5 millibars and again we need to press F2 to start. It will now count down for another minute. And now our minute is up. So you can see the start was 20.56. We increased to 20.61. So we've gone up 0.053. Now we need to press F2 because it can do whatever it wants. So if it had gone over 21 millibars, I would have reduced it down. If it dropped down to 19 millibars, I would have taken it up to 20 millibars. So we need to press F2 now for our tightness test and F2 again to start. Away we go. And now we've got two minutes. Now our two minutes up, you can see we went from 20.7 to 20.77. So we had an increase. So again, it's passed after the two minutes. So again, we press the F2. Now you can see we can save it by pressing F2 or we can send it to the printer by pressing F1. So let's send it to a printer press F1 so we have to press O2 again to say OK but there's no printer connected so that's using the unit itself let's have a go now by using the app on my smartphone <laughs> 